Yes, sir, too, Mr. Guy. And so, as y'all know, we got Kia Base. What? Yes, sir, and we got Old Blue. <laughs> to the family, Black Magic. Yes, sir, too. So it's finally here, man. The big reveal. Yes, sir. This is our new SPL project, man. That's why we kind of stopped on Kid Base right where we was, man. We got enough action in Kid Base. Yes, sir. Flexing, floating. Yes, indeed. Right now, we call Kia Base the 2K Kia, being powered by the VFL 4800. It's more than enough, man. But, back to the business. Like I said, man, we got our project, and it needed a lot of work, man. Didn't have a rear bumper, had a few issues with the engine, suspension, and everything like that. But, like I say, man, a few months later, everything is good, man. Yes, sir, the 98 Dodge Ram van. Yes, sir, man, like I said, I gave y'all a brief clue as to what I was going to be working with, but now you can see it, man. Over 100 cubes to work with. Man, full size Dodge Ram band, man. <laughs> like I said, we had a long list of work to do on the van, man. Just to show y'all, you know, this is a base channel, not a mechanic channel, but we do do that type of work too. But anyway, this is the list of what needed to be done to the van when we got it, man. I won't read everything, I'll just let you see. Okay, the price is over there. That's just the first page, man. Get on to the second page. Yes, sir, 98 Dodge Ram van. Total. Yes, sir. And that's just in getting the, the parts and everything functioning correctly. Now, of course, you know, we didn't pay that. We did it ourselves. But, you know, we went to them to get the estimate to see what I was going on. We know there were some issues with the steering and control arms and things like that. So... Rather than to rack our brain, man, we took it to them, let them tell us, and a few months later, the van is ready to go, man. Like I say, we chose to start, like everybody should, with the engine and running parts. <laughs> you know, we got little minor issues to address door dings no big issue man we pop them out or we just get brand new doors you know. when I got it it didn't have a back bumper and as you know on these cars the back bumper is where the tag is so we got that put on 
situated. Yes, sir, too, man. Just real basic things, man. This is the preliminary. So, as y'all probably figured out now, but if not, this is where all the zero gauge and all of that wire was for. We got a temporary setup in there right now. And I say temporary because, as everybody know, this is the wall build. We gonna go, go in here, man, a lot. But like I say right now, we got the 2K Kia because the 8K is in the van, man. Along with the Odyssey, yes sir. <coughs> and of course, all of that is powering. Yes sir, the two LVSs. Same box from the truck. So yeah, man. Like I said, this is temporary. Only reason we threw this in here was so that we could find our rattles. Yes, sir. As you know, once you put the wall in, it's not accessible to take back out and seal or dynamat or anything like that, man. Once the wall in, this is done data. So we put these in to try to find all our rattles and issues and, you know, just to see how our truck, how our van responds to base, man. And let me tell you, gets down. Flex City all day. But, like I said, man, we, we'll get to that Friday. The Flex Friday. We have the Black Magic. The black base van flexing everything, man. But like I say, man, it's just a quick introduction and reveal of the new project. Yes, sir, it's your guy. And we out of there, man. Oh, love. Oh, why don't you know why is this enough?